everybody. Hi, welcome. If you are new, I'm Laura. Zena is my brown puppy dog and White is my white puppy dog and they love to hang out with me while I create videos. If you're returning, huge thank you for the amazing support. Super happy that you chose to spend a little bit of your day with me and my very furry sidekicks because today I am opening my favorite style box, my Transcend. Transcend is through the store Ever Eve and they do curate your styles into outfits for you. You tend to get um, between seven plus styles, and I believe like the more you keep throughout your boxes, they tend to add a few more styles. $20 styling fee, keep what you love, send back what you don't. If you keep four or more items, you will get 10% off what you keep. Uh, you can tell your stylist particular items that you want, or if you use the same email address on the Trendsend site as you do on the Evereve site, you can put items on your wish list and your stylist will have the ability to see those items. And a lot of times we'll add some of those styles into your boxes. All right, they also have theme boxes. So if you're not sure what you're looking for, you could choose one of their themes. They have the Hot Mama box. I think they have a... Uh, We'll call it the a fall transition. I think it's called the transitions box. Uh, they have an active box. Um, I'm not giving you all the right theme names because they have very creative names, but there's a bunch of them. So if you're not sure what to ask for, go with a themed box for your first box. And I'll put my link down below. If you use my link, you'll get 20% uh, off the items that you keep from your first box, and I get 20% off the items in my next box. All right, so when I open it up, first thing I see is a little note from my stylist. My stylist is Haley, and she rocks. And there's also my pricing sheet. Here is, looks like she's starting to think transition. I can see some um, styles that follow it more towards fall. You do get a bag to return anything you don't love and don't want to keep. They do send accessories as well as shoes. See, now, I don't even think you saw her yet, but she's ready to make an escape and go exploring. She likes to do that throughout the room, so sometimes she bumps the camera, sometimes she makes noise. She's her own girl. First bundle. All right, I have something from Cloth and Stone. This is called the Sapphire Plaid Tie Front Shirt. And I have to tell you, this is incredibly soft. So I typically don't like um, tie front shirts, but I'm very intrigued by this. So this is a darker print. So this does feel a little bit more fall transition-y, but this is incredibly soft. It is stretchy. It feels amazing. And I might actually really like this. <laughs> They do have the sleeves rolled and they are a tab sleeve, but I'm sure you could undo that if you wanted. I like the blues and the greens, so we'll check that out. Next up is the Haley Polo Rib Tank by Every, which is their house, one of their house brands. They have several. That also, lots of stretch. Then we have a sweater also by Ever Eve. This one's called the Arabella Striped Sweater Top. This one's in short sleeve. Kind of got the little holes going through it, that uh, loose weave stitching. Okay, and she paired all of that with cut from the cloth. And these are the Meg Wide Leg. I do love a cut from the cloth. These are nice. They have an unfinished hem. I like the wide leg. Those are cute. All right, that's the first outfit. Next, what do we have? She's keeping this in a similar color palette. Um, this is a top by... LA Made. This is the Esme Ruffled Racer Tank. Oh, and that's pretty. Not a bad ruffle. I like the blue color. There's the racer back. 
And then it looks like I have a little set here. So this is by Ever Eve, the Olivia Paisley V-neck tank. All right, so I have to look at, <laughs> if you all know, Paisley is not one of my favorite prints. I can't help it, it's just not one of my favorites. This one's not quite as bad, so I might be able to overlook it. Although I do, I'm, I'm very much seeing the Paisley now. Here's the top. It's sleeveless, it's a V-neck, and it's got the elastic bottom. You can see that Paisley in there. And then it has a matching uh, skirt. That is adorable. Here's the front. I do own probably two Paisley items that I like. Um, so I'm not 100% against it. It's just not one of my favorite patterns, but this isn't bad. And then she paired it with a jacket. This is by Every. I actually think I might have had this on my wish list. Um, this is the Jagger Moto jacket by Ever Even This White. I like this crisp white. Zippers at the bottom there. Here's the back. Yeah, that's really nice. This uh, material is a lightweight material, so that's really cute. All right, smaller bundle. This is something from Faherty. Little top, that's cute. And a um, uh, lightweight um, crepey or, let's see, what does it say? This is called the Lucia top. And it has the detail around the neckline there. That's really pretty. This is a nice hot day type of top. I like that. Next is something by Rails. This is a similar top, different material. Has the button detail in the front. Great pattern. We gathered around the neckline. And she paired it with these shorts. These are, oh, it's a skirt by Faraday. Two tops with this skirt. That's cute, little cargo skirt. Okay, one more bundle, and I also, she sent me shoes. A little tank. This is by a Spiritual Gangster. And on the back, it says, do all things with love. And she has a pair of shorts here by Z Supply. So cozy little pull on shorts. Nice. And a little pullover, also by Z Supply. That's cute. Little outfit, I like that. For when it gets cooler, put this on. That's a cute set. All right, and my last item, shoes. They just uh, started sending shoes within the last several months, and I like that they send shoes. Check these out. These are nice. Oh, I like those. I think with Nordstrom, I'd actually told them Trunk Club before they were gone. I was looking for a pair of a black uh, slides. So here you go. This is a fun um, animal print, cute heel. I hope they fit. And we're ready for the try on. Let's do this. First outfit. All right, so I think I'm gonna go in order that I took them out of the box for you. And I put on the cut from the cloth, except for the shoes, um, but the cut from the cloth denim and the cloth and stone top. So I'm in love with the cut from the cloth denim. She did size down and sent me a zero and that's perfection. Fits me perfectly in the waist, fits in the hip and thigh area. Length is really good for me. They probably are supposed to be cropped for me, they're more ankle hit right at my ankle bone. And then I did put on the Vince Camuto shoe with this. All right, so basically, I'm shocked to say I love everything. <laughs> I love everything. Um, if you're looking for a wide leg, these are actually quite perfect. 
Um, and cloth and stone tends to be a reasonably priced denim brand, so I do really, really like these. Um, I already know I'm going to want to keep these. The shoes are really nice. The only thing I noticed was they make a little bit of noise while I'm walking, the, walking in them. Hopefully they'll, that will break in. But the heel is a little bit high, but so far comfortable. And um, they're not cutting my toes off, so that's another thing that's really, really good. And I'm liking that they have this pattern in them. They aren't just a matte black. So I like that as well. That little bit of shine and texture is a really nice addition. And then the funky heel, I also am really liking. You can dress these up, keep them casual, good for work, good for, for fun. Again, I like that about both of them. And then this t-shirt or the top, the button down, um, it does have buttons. They're covered buttons. And then it does have this tie. And this is one of the softest tops I think I've ever worn. So Cloth & Stone is a pricier brand, but their fabrications are amazing. It does have the tab sleeves, but you could also unbutton it and wear it down. I think for transition, probably keeping it cuffed is nice and you don't really notice the tab sleeve so well. Um, it comes down to right there. If I'm, like, it's not uh, curled or anything, that's where it hits. So it has a nice lay to it. Um, it just may show a little bit of stomach as you're moving. You can see if I raise my hands, it's going to go up pretty high. Now, I don't typically do that. If you're just in the normal course of movement, um, won't really show that much. Or you could just put a tank on underneath this if that bothers you. Here's a closer look so you can see these pretty colors. It does have the pockets in the front. I'm enjoying the blue and the greens. And then the jeans. And here's another close-up look at these shoes. All right, so pricing for these, the Vince Camuto Rakenda Mule, 119 is the regular price. Now, once again, one of my amazing subscribers did use my link down below, so I so appreciate you using my referral link. Um, so I'm getting 20% of anything I decide to keep from this box. So a huge, huge thank you. It really allows me to keep on bringing you these boxes, allows me to keep creating videos. So thank you, thank you for using my links. I so appreciate it. So if I decide to keep them, my price would be $95.20. And then remember, if I keep four or more items, another 10% would come off of that. And then the Cloth & Stone Sapphire Plaid Tie Front Shirt, $98 is the regular price, $78.40 if I want to keep it. The cut from the cloth, Meg Wide Leg, $99, $79.20 would be my price. So next up is the Ever Eve Polo Tank. This one is nice. Here's a, I'm just going to back up so you can see the full outfit. I left the shoes on just so you can continue to see them. Um, this tank is a very stretchy material. It does have a deeper V. It has the collar and it's in kind of a, a skin tone. And it is very comfortable. It would be, go with a lot of different things. Here's the back. Here's a closer look. Here's what it looks like out. So you can see how long it is. It's not very long. It's right below the waistband. Another great transition. And she did mention in her notes that um, a lot of the fall items are coming in. So a lot of these pieces are wear now and wear into fall. So they start to begin that transition. So this one is called the Ever Eve Haley Polo Rib Tank in Camel. And $58 is the regular price, $46.40 if I choose to keep it. Next is the Ever Eve Arabella striped sweater. This one has that loose weave. It does have the banded wrist. You could probably put it above or below your elbow, wherever it's most comfortable. Here's the back, it does have the banded bottom. You could do a front tuck, leave it out. Definitely um, has the fall vibes going on with it. Here's what it looks like close up. You can see that open weave. This one is $98 and my price would be 
Next up is the Paisley matching set. All right, so this does have pockets. The um, top has an elastic band as well as the skirt has an elastic band. The uh, mules look really nice with this, so I kept them on. Has the flouncy bottom. I think my tag is sticking out here, I saw, so we'll tuck that in. This has a very nice fit and feel to it. So it's creating that blousey um, top to create a waist for you. Nothing is restrictive. So again, it'd be great for the hotter days. This has a great flow to it. It's not tight at the hips, so it feels really nice on. Hits at that midi length. Great sway and movement, which I really enjoy. Here's closer up so you can see this pattern. The elastic waist here has that v-neck you can wear them separately wear them together so you have options and then she also sent the white moto jacket with it as well so white would really brighten it up for right now you could also do a denim jacket which would also look really nice there is white in this This jacket has some incredible stretch to it. The sleeves are cuffed, but you won't have to keep them cuffed. So if you needed more length, you could uncuff them. Here's what it looks like zippered. You can go up as far or as little as you like. Hits at the hip. Closer look. incredible stretch like this has some really nice stretch to it all right so for these items the ever eve jagger moto jacket 168 my price would be 134 40 and then the olivia paisley v-neck tank 78 my price would be 62 40 and the olivia paisley skirt 88, my price 70, 40. And then for a different look, she sent me this LA Made top, which I think is very nice and very, very soft. So check this out with a little bit of ruffle, but because it cuts in, it kind of takes away from that super frilly, girly look. And I really enjoy that. I like the color. It's kind of got that ocean blue going on. Looks nice with the skirt. Kind of gives it a different look. Now I have the wrong bra on for this. You would need a T-back bra for this. But I kind of like it. Looks nice with the skirt. Here's what it looks like out. I tucked it all the way in, but just so you can see what it looks like, because it has some nice flow to it. And hits at the hip. And this one is called the LA Made Esme Ruffled Racer Tank, $68, my price $54.40. Next up is the Faraday outfit. All right, so when I pull out a skirt like this one, I tend to cringe because a lot of times it doesn't fit me because it's a very boxy style. And when you are hippie and have a butt, those tend to not fit you. I'm very pleasantly surprised by this skirt. It does fit me. It has plenty of room um, where I need it, which is the hip and butt area. It's not restrictive. It's actually got a lot of movement um, and it's very comfortable. The length is also nice. It's a little shorter, but I actually like it. Um, be great for those hot days. And it's in this nice green color, which makes it a neutral and it'll go with a lot. Um, does have the belt, buck, belt loops and it has the patch pockets in the front no pockets in the back. Paired it with the Faraday gauzy top that has that deep notched collar and then this uh, stitching down the front. Let me show you here. How pretty is that? Has kind of the um, off the shoulder uh, look and then it does have, it's covered here. So even though it looks like it kind of has the open arms, it does not, it's covered. 
And this makes for a nice uh, summer look. Again, it would be great for transition. Uh, and it's just an overall nice um, summer look. Here's what this looks like out. It is longer. And you could easily just do a front tuck as well if you didn't want a full tuck. And these pieces are the Lucia top in white, 128, my price would be 10240. The utility mini skirt 118, my price would be 9440. Next up is the rails top. So this is another really pretty pairing with the utility skirt. This has a, a little bit of a flutter type sleeve. It also has the notched collar and then the button down. The colors in this are really pretty. Would pair nicely with a denim jacket. So put that on top. I did a full tuck. You could do a half tuck. Here's a closer look. You can see all these pretty colors. Has a little bit of pleating here around the, the collar. I think I might like this one a little bit better than the um, Faraday top. It has a little bit more structure, not quite as boxy. Here's what this one looks like out. This one is by Rails. Rails is another pricey brand. Um, regular price is $148. My price would be $118.40. It's called the Alina Mod floral top. I like it. It is, I think these are very pretty together. It makes for a really sleek look. Very chic. We've made it to the last outfit and it's a good thing because my hair is at the point now where it's all starting to get messy because I've tried on so many clothes. So perfect timing. I have on the Z Supply shorts with the Spiritual Gangster tank. This is such a nice, comfy outfit. Perfect for travel in the car, um, travel anywhere, actually, plane, car, whatever, train, whatever your source of travel is. Great for lounging at any time. A nice, cute beach outfit. Great for bathing suit cover up. So I like this one. It's kind of good for all things. Weekend wear, if you have kids, um, baseball games or hockey games or any of those things. Hockey, you might need more clothes. <laughs> but any of those outside um, sports events for your kids that you need to go to, this would be a great outfit. Um, I actually really like it. I think it'd be great for um, traveling. So easy, comfy, tie waist shorts, a cute tank in a nice color. They'll be great for transition. Has a nice saying in the back. I just put on flip flops. And then you top it off when it cools off with this uh, pullover in this same cozy, comfy fabric, which is, what is the fabric? Of course, I'm reading it upside down. It's cotton and polyester, so 80% cotton, 20% polyester. It just feels nice and cozy. So what do you think? It's kind of oversized. I really like it. I love that it kind of, it, it's a set. Obviously, I think you could wear it a lot of different ways. You can obviously wear them individually or together. Again, great for packing to take with you. Nice, cozy topper. Here's a closer look. Has this nice little notch top. Has the collar. It does, it does it have pockets? No, no pockets. Just pockets in the shorts. All right, for the final items, the Spiritual Gangster All Things Muscle Tank, $48. My price would be $30.40 with the 20% off. Z Supply Astrid Short, $49. My price $39.20. And the Z Supply Mave Mauve Top, um, $79. My price would be $63.20. So many good things in this collection. What do you think the keepers are? All right, so first of all, I do like this whole outfit. I think this is just great to have um, for traveling, for vacation, for weekend. Um, I really like it. I can even wear this to work from home. This top is, it would be perfectly fine. 
Um, I actually really love this skirt. If uh, I suggest if you're looking for a great utility skirt, this one is awesome. Um, the fabrication is worth the splurge. I think that I actually like the rails top better with it than I do the, the um, crepey one, the gauzy one. But let me know which one you liked. I like them both, um, but I can't keep them both. It would be just too much money. So let me know which one you like better. This outfit. So I surprisingly liked this, even though I told you Paisley is not my favorite print. But I really like them. I love this top. I definitely would like to keep it. I love the ocean blues. It'll go with so much. Let me know what you thought about this. I think this was a uh, fit was great. I like the idea of it. I'm trying to think if I would grab for it, but I do like it. I could wear it to work. I could wear it um, for other things as well. I did really like the white, white um, moto jacket. So I am thinking about that one as well. Loved, loved the, the uh, cut pants, so I'm going to keep those. I didn't really love this. I don't know what it is about it, but there's something about it that just did not speak to me. I thought this was nice. I could probably part with it and not be too upset. I surprisingly loved this. <laughs> I don't know why, but I really enjoyed it. And if, I wish that you could feel it because I think that you would understand. And then I love the shoes. So I'm in trouble here, you can tell. <laughs> I think I only told you about one thing I didn't like and two others that I could potentially part with. That's problematic. Um, I probably need to narrow it down a bit more. So share your favorites with me down below. All of these items will be listed. I'll put my link to Trendsend in case you give, want to give it a try. I do love it. Um, you can work with your stylist as to your price points, your styles, your favorites, your needs, the things that are coming up that you would like items for. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I had so much fun. If you enjoyed it, please do hit that like before you go. I'd love you to hang up for long haul. Hit that subscribe. It allows me to keep on doing this. If you already have, a huge, huge thank you. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.